just a moment. But we start tonight with a look at the cleanup from this weekend storm that knocked down trees and power lines across the area. News Channel Line's Stephanie Sanastasi joins us now live with a look at other problems that caused people some headaches. Stephanie. Kevin, Latricia, we're on Signal Mountain right now, and as a result of those storms that you said this past weekend, many people are now dealing with this. You'll see the caution tape that's up right now, and if you look down the road there, you'll see those trees now laying in the middle of the road. That tree back there it even pulled down some telephone lines, and many people living around here are now left with a big bill to get these trees cleaned up. <laughs> A busy afternoon on Signal Road. Just scoot it on forward for now till I start getting stuff down, see how it goes. For Dustin Blewett and his crew. Blewett is the owner of Blewett Tree Service. We're experiencing a lot of problems with trees, trees coming down this year. A lot of the trees got water stress and have died and decayed in the roots to some extent. And when they're still kind of like fully leafed out, but have some decay in the roots, that's usually when they come down. And that's exactly what happened to this tree outside of the Ford's home. Michelle Ford says her family has lived here for four years. I was actually kind of sad that it was that tree because that tree's so beautiful and um, it's our only large tree in the front yard. Ford's thankful the tree didn't fall on their house or any of her neighbor's homes. After she got over the initial shock of it all. We called the police first of all um, just because we felt like they needed to come out and because we felt like it was a hazard because it was precariously perched on the tops of the trees across the street. And because it was partly hanging over a town road, Ford was hoping she wouldn't have to foot the entire bill to get it cleaned up. It would be nice. But the town says this job was bigger than what they could handle. They say the Fords are responsible to pay for Blewett services. A town spokesperson does tell me that they will work with those contractors. If any leaves or sticks are left in the road, the town will help clean that part of it up. For now, reporting live on Signal Mountain, Stephanie Sanastasi, News Channel 9.